I was sitting minding my business. And y'all cousin Kevin hit me with the conjoined twins, Abby and Brittany. And now here I am, then got all up into the biznaee. Blame it on Kevin. Let's talk about the conjoined twins, Abby and Brittany. Get married, child. Everybody needs a sweet old auntie. Everybody needs with a little whoop and a boop, boop, boop. Auntie, everybody needs a sweet old auntie. You can't make this up. Now you know that these are some crazy motherfuckers. Everybody needs a sweet old auntie. So why? Auntie's a sweet old auntie. Auntie's a queen. Are you okay? Are you okay? Well, welcome back, everybody, and this is Auntie, and if this is your first time being here, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and to all of my new subscribers, thank you all so much for hitting that subscribe button and joining this family. To all of my nieces, nephews, and my members who have been here with me for the long haul, thank you all so much for your continued support. So the other day, honey, I was minding my business. And y'all cousin Kevin hit me up <laughs> in the Instagram DMs and was talking about this story. And I was like, wait a minute, what? <laughs> what is going on? And so because I've been up late, working late at night and all of that kind of stuff, I was like, let me go out here and see what Kevin's talking about. Ciao, 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 ciao. He was talking about the Conjoy twins, y'all. They didn't get messed around and got married downtown to the 2021 and ain't tell nobody. <laughs> honey, 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 honey. Now, I remember these girls from back in the day. So I am going to read a little bit, y'all. We're going to talk a little bit and then we're going to get the hell up and out of here, okay? Child, according to people in an article dated April 3rd, child. Okay, no, not that one. Is it this one? Hold on, y'all. Let me see. No, it's not this one. It's this one. Is it this one? Hold on, because I got a couple of them open. Dated on March 28th, Us Weekly. And I'm going to put all the articles, the full articles down in the com um, in the description box for y'all. It says, who is conjoined to an Abby Hansel who got secretly married two years ago, what to know, okay? So they said the conjoined twins, Abby, Hansel, and Brittany got a little, um, family got a big, a little bigger when Abby tied the knot with her husband, Josh Bowling, two years ago. Abby, which I don't know which one is which, and maybe if I bring this up, y'all will know which one is which. Let me see if y'all know which one is which. Hold on. <laughs> Because I don't know which one to twitch, okay? Y'all going to have to tell me. Hold on, let me share this screen so I can show y'all the twins. So here go the twins, y'all. Y'all see them. Now, from my understanding, they have separate heads. Um, separate, I think I want to say, you know what? Let me not guess, bitch. Okay, here go the twins. <laughs> here go the twins, okay? There they go. They right there. Okay. Abby married him. He's an army vet. In a private ceremony in November of 2001, 
At the time, the newlyweds, along with their extended family, shared a series of photos and videos of the wedding, including snapshots from what appeared to be the couple's first dance. Since the nuptials, right, the Hansels and Bowlings have made a life for themselves in Minnesota, where the twins work as fifth grade teachers, according to today. Okay, they said that she got, you know, her little stuff on her thing. Um, so the two of them, of course, I know. Okay, so who is Abby? Abby is the left side. Oh, okay, let me look. Let me look, bitch. Abby is the left side. Wait a minute, what? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, who? Okay, uh, all right, I, I need y'all help. <laughs> Let me bring this up and y'all tell me what's the left and what's the right, damn it, because I don't know. Hold on, let me put this on here. <laughs> y'all gonna have to help y'all damn auntie. What the, okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute, what? Abby is the left side conjoined twin to Brittany. So, bitch, if I'm sitting on the left, wait a minute, hold on. Okay, so if I'm left, that means that that's the one with the shades on top of her head. Okay, both of them got shades on their head. Okay, so it's the one with the earring in her nose, y'all? Is it the one with the earring on the nose? It got to be the one with the earring on the no on the nose. It got to be. Let me blow this up. I see Ray Della getting on y'all. Y'all better. <laughs> y'all better act like y'all know. <laughs> okay. So why to go back there? Hold on. Let me blow this up. What the, is going on here? All right. Hold on. Okay. So it's the one that's sitting with the nose thing in her ring, in her nose, the ring in her nose. I don't know. I don't even know. I swear to God, I don't know. They say after their birth in 1990, their parents, Mike, opted against a separation surgery as they were told that it was unlikely both sisters would survive. The two, some are Dice pa, Los, Los, Laos, conjoined twins, a rare form of partial twinning with two heads side by side on one torso. They share a bloodstream and all their organs below the waist. Abby controls their right arm and leg, while Brittany controls the left. I remember when these little girls was born. I remember all of this stuff. But child, I don't know which one, which one. So if you're looking for me to do the rocket signs for you, child, they said that the Abby is the one that's on the live child. She the one that done married the damn man. Okay? That's all I know. That's all I got. But people have been coming out and saying little smart about them, right? You know, just being, you know, angry and disrespectful. But we do want to know, okay? We do, we, we do want to know because I'm curious. I don't know if, if, if I'm just a nosy or what. I probably am, but I'm curious my daggone self. Now, I want to know. What's going on down there? Okay, because I'm just saying, it's just, is, is, is it natural? If it ain't natural for me to want to know, then I'm unnatural because I 
I want to know. I want to know. Okay. I want to know. I want to know. Okay. So let's go ahead on and read what's going on because they didn't came out there downtown to the, they didn't came downtown. Hold on for a second. Let me see something. Hold on. Because, child, they didn't got married. Let me see. Hold on. Can't do it. So, first of all, they done came out and said that the daggone daddy, the husband, is facing a paternity suit from his ex-wife. So this article came out yesterday, I mean today. A suit has been filed on March 23rd, nearly two years after Josh and Abby got married. Now, Abby's husband is Josh. Now, mind you, Brittany is dating somebody else, child. They must have really had to discuss this because I ain't got this to do. <laughs> I'd have been like, girl, nah, we girl. Because from the waist down, you doing it. You, you know what I'm... Uh -huh. Is it me that's curious? I'm curious. But anyway, let's go ahead on and talk about this husband and this lawsuit. So they said the case was filed by his wife, his ex-wife, Anika, on October 2nd, about two years after they got married. Anika filed a lawsuit against both Josh, Josh, a nurse and the United States Army vet, and an individual named Galvin. Wait a minute, bitch, what? It may concern the paternity of Anika's youngest daughter, who was born after she split from John. However, the doc documents do not name the child in question because they are minors. A genetic test report was added to the file on March 7th, according to court records. However, neither details about the test nor its results are publicly available. Anika... And Josh, who wedded in 2010, separated in 2019. They shared custody of a daughter named Isabella. So in 2020, after the couple split, Anika had another daughter. And that child is three. It may be that this child, okay, people reached out to Abby, but she had no comment on it. I wouldn't have either. I want to be So now after this, now the twins is talking about on child on Snoops. They done talked about their sex life. Now, remember, they was on TLC, okay? So let me show their pictures again for all of y'all that's coming in and saying, Auntie, what the hell are you doing? Okay, hold on. Ray Della, do I need to handle something down there, down, 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 down to the chat? Do I need to handle something down there to the chat? Okay. All right. Now hold on.
So again, these are the twins. The wife is the one on the left hand side. So it got to be this one right here. It got to be the one with the swoop to the side. It got to be the one that's not showing her teeth because that's the left side of the body. So she the left side, right? If the wife is on the left side, then that's this sister right here. That's her. It got to be. Uh-oh, they saying this rating is fake. Hold on. Oh, this fake. They saying this is fake. Oh, no, we ain't got it to do. We ain't got it to do. We ain't got no fake news up on here. Mm -mm. No, because they saying that they, that they shared this in a post and up at the top. It said that this joint is fake news. And what we're not doing over here is defending them sisters with no fake news. But I do wonder, what do she do? And if they if, if they are sharing that body, ain't they feeling the same thing? Do we got a doctor up in the house? Do they feel the same thing, y'all? Yeah, the paternity suit is real. That's from people. Right? Hold on. That's from people. And people usually get their stuff straight. But do the conjoined twins, they got to because they share everything from the bottom down. So do the other one, is the other one going to get married? Because they were saying she got a boyfriend. They said she got a boy. Child. So that means that if, if they have a baby, are they both mothers or? Because how, if they share in the same womb. Child, this is confusing as hell. That's why Kevin all into this. Because this is confused. I'm confused. That's my last name. Confused. Auntie confused. Because, like, you want them to have a normal life, right? But how can you have, a, I guess, for them, that is normal. You know what I'm saying? For them, it is normal. And I guess, the, you know, if one have a baby, then they both had a baby. Because if they both married to one another, so that's how I'm looking at it. So right now, right, if they was to get pregnant, it's Abby, Abby the mother. But what happens if the two of them both got husbands and then they get pregnant? So do they, like, how do they find out, like, do they have different DNA? Like, I'm so confused. Hold on, because I, I don't like being confused like this. Do they have the same DNA? I, I Do they have the same DNA? Let me see. Yeah, they say they say as identical twins, some have the same DNA. Conjoined twins have the same DNA. So conjoined twins have one DNA, not two. Unlike identical twins, conjoined twins share their mutations because they are connected. However, if the conjoined twins have separate reproductive organs, Germline mutations are not shared, but these two don't. They have the same reproductive system because they are, they share the same body downtown to the waist. 
So that would mean that Yeah. Now, one of the sisters is a teacher, but the other sister ain't. So I guess she just goes to the school. <laughs> is she unemployed? Y'all got to help me out. Do the, do, uh, ain't one of them work? At, from my understanding, one was working and the other one ain't working. Okay. From my understanding, one of them ain't working. It says both Abby and Brittany. Oh, okay. Both, okay. Both I'm working. Okay. Because I thought one was an unemployed. She just was going to the school because she had no choice. But according to Us Weekly, they said both Abby and Brittany are currently working as fifth grade teachers. The twins began working in the educational field shortly after graduating college. They said math and science is kind of their strong. Oh, Abby said math and science is her strong point, where Brittany said that she is more focused on the language arts, reading and stuff like that. So are they teaching the same subject or are they switching back and forth through classes? Like, I ain't even trying to be funny. I'm just like... I ain't even trying to be funny. I ain't trying to shade them. I ain't like, I ain't trying to do nothing. I'm just trying to understand it. Like Kevin, Kevin is the one that got me on this book. Okay. Talk about, you know, this was, you know, <laughs> this was getting him and it's getting me too, because I'm thinking, you know, out of sight, out of mind, ain't nobody seen them child. You find out that they married child. They got the, she got, Abby got the husband and the husband happened to be married to somebody else child. And now they downtown, she got to be going to court with four paternity suit with his ass and her sister going to have to go with her. Brittany got go to. Like they done did everything together. And I remember when the parents were saying that they did not want to separate them because of the likelihood that they was only going to have one child. So they stayed together. And I know that they somewhere I read that they said the statistics of them living past a year old was just virtually impossible. So, you know, of course we was watching them and everything. You know what I mean? I'm just like, what in the whole, you know, well, what? And but to see years later that they got married. Did I show y'all the wedding pictures? Let me show y'all the wedding pictures of the twins. Hold on. Okay. Y'all got a right to see the wedding pictures. Let me let me see if I can get a wedding picture up on here somewhere. But I don't know why they secretly got married. Like that's what I'm I'm having a problem with understanding, right? But hold on, let me see if I can get their um, wedding picture. Child, they downtown to them. They, I mean, like they downtown to the um. Hold on, y'all. Let me get this picture up. Like, they had a full-fledged wedding. Oh, yeah, did she go with her husband? Hold on. Shall I tell you? You know, one thing about it, though, life is what you make it. And if you can, oh my God, and if you can find love, and it's so wild because this one is laughing, right? But I swear to God, this one is on the right side, bitch. Like, what the hell? Okay, so wait a minute, y'all. Y'all help me with this book, okay? Because this one is up there smiling and everything looking like she is deeply in love. But I swear to God, they said she on the right side. Like, wait a minute. Did do they got these sides right? Okay, y'all, y'all look at this picture and tell me if the other one ain't looking just like she in love.
She, do y'all see that? She's smiling like a monk. Okay. I mean, she smells a hard, but she's on the she's on the right hand side, right? Oh my God! So they said in this article in E News, Brittany and Abby understand people's curiosity. But they understand it to a point. They said, you know, they still get frustrated at the reaction they get when they meet people in public. Especially when people try and take photos of them without their damn permission. And then they said, um, doctors were curious about their health and growing process as children. While they are unique, the family treats them like they just like anybody else. Bitch, which one is the bride? I am so confused. Because the other one is grinning so hard that it's just making me like, you know what I'm saying? It's just making me kind of like, like, it's kind of like giving me like the side eye in a way. Okay, so let me bring her up because why isn't he standing like, if she's on, a, if, if she's on, I think this article wrong. I think she got to be the chick on the right. Y'all remember that song? I bet you got a chick on the side. Sure you do. It said, I bet you got a chick on the side. Oh, he got a chick on the side now. <laughs> oh, he got a chick on the side. She just right on the left-hand side or the right-hand side. But he sure enough got him a chick on the side. Okay, so y'all look at this picture. Which one is the bride? Didn't they say that Abby is on a... You know what? Let me Google this on my phone. I'm confused at it. What side is Abby on? Let me see. Okay. What? Hold on. Is Abby the conjoined... Conjoined, co, co-joined sister on the left side, bitch. Is she on the left side or the right side? I gotta find out. I, I I'm sorry, y'all. I can't. I can't. It... Abby, the one that done married him, controls the right arm. Okay. Okay. Okay, so Brittany the one on the left. Okay, so then that's right then. Okay, so who? Because I was like, why is she, she standing there? So then in the picture that we just saw downtown to the wedding, where's the picture downtown to the wedding? Okay, okay, so she should be smiling and laughing. Because I was like, wait a minute, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Why is her ass up here smiling and laughing? Because she on the right-hand side. So, you know, the article that I read before, see, she was on the left-hand side, so I was confused about that. Because I was like, come on, sis. Now I know you happy. I know you happy and everything, sis, but what we ain't going to do is be smiling and kiki and cock on like that. So that's 
So now that makes more sense. That was wrong. She on the right hand side. Brittany is on the left hand side. Because I was come. Okay. 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 Now they saying they want kids. Child, they saying they want kids. <laughs> I think it's normal for all of us to have questions. I think it's fair. They said that, you know, it's not a lot of them in this world. So, yeah, we're going we gonna to have questions. Because I know when it get down to it, it's very rare that we see something like this, right? Like, seriously, I don't want nobody to feel bad because they asking a question. We all ignorant to it, right? We ain't studying on this. We're not doctors. We don't know about nothing. You know what I'm saying? We don't know nothing about this stuff, which is what makes their life very interesting. And they see that the sisters, that, you know, they both realize that people got questions. And it's just a normal thing. So don't beat up on yourself because you don't know. You understand what I'm saying? Don't beat up on yourself because I know we all curious to know what's going on. And I'm going to leave it like that. Anyway, y'all, I just wanted to bring this to y'all. Again, I will make sure that I put in the description box all the links to the full in the full um, um, articles so that y'all can get caught up on this. Because, child, when they have a baby, y'all know I'm going to have my right back out again. I love y'all. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. Bye, y'all.